office. The road to the capital is littered with the corpses of Yushka's men. Bodies crushed to a pulp on the frozen ground. It isn't hard to track down the cause of this destruction. But doing something about it is much more difficult. And welcome back everyone to Homecoming. A little detour quest. Looks like we're fighting some sort of dinosaur. Let's see what kind of a deck we have. Looks like still mostly the same. Let's keep going. Hmm, no two drops. That looks a little bit more playable. Get that thing's attention. We need to lead it away from the city. Getting its attention is easy. Now what? Ready. Aim. Like we had a pretty good start this time. Looks like we made it mad. <laughs> I guess that's a start. That was a bit easier than the last mission. You risked your life for strangers. Somebody had to. Let's see what we get here. Deterrence, killer, ambush, and pledge. That's a really nasty combo. That might uh, that might warrant some dinosaur decks. Let's see what happens. We are nearing the capital, but have nothing to lead us to the resistance, if it even exists. Rumors swirl like snowflakes in the wind. We come to a crossroad where a mob has bound a man in priest robes to a stake. But the wood of their pyre is wet and cold, and the sparks aren't taking. Just as often as not, a man that a mob would silence is likely someone worth talking to. Same deck. Looks like the same deck. I'm gonna take a guess and say this is something with, his, with the Xenian cults. With, uh... Uh, what's his name? Uh, big uh, radiant. Oh no, it's Flame Brewer. It's a card I have actually.
Give yourself up to the truth, heretic. And Yushkov Seer may grant you mercy. Then come. Light your pyre. I will not tell that madman where the fox hides. Did you hear that? We have to stop this. These are your people, Svetya. Remind them of that. Okay, so we're fighting... We're freeing that uh, cleric. I think I've seen the card before from the spoilers. And Flame Brewer works for Yushkov. Okay. You've got a choice, Mike. Drive that back! I am Svetia Katarina Stormheart Kurtz, rightful Orin of Kosul. I command you, put down that torch. <laughs> Not a chance, girl. Ignite! want to trade with that so I'll just play the crack Ready. shot pass. Aim. Flawless escape. That is a very large sharpshooter. Choose your side. Charge! Charge! Finish them! Ignite! You can do this. Do I make this look easy? Here we go. Maximum over damage. Are you part of the resistance, friend? I am no fighter, but I do what I can to bring comfort to those who suffer under Yushkov. If you are who you claim to be, you must come with me. Call for aid. That seems like a pretty powerful spell, I mean... Power Stone costs two, so you're paying two to pay a Power Stone and also two to draw a card and gain one health. I'd play that. I'd play that card. It was useful. Andrik leads us to the outskirts of the capital. We ransacked an abandoned estate that someone has fortified. Milos and I enter the darkened courtyard and finally come face to face with this fox.
Hello, sister. Cameron, you... you're alive. Yes, and no thanks to you. I crawled through ice and mud to escape the slaughter. Andrek saved my life and hid me from Yushkov. Where have you been? In Argentport, trying to get help. And you arrived unharmed with this rabble? Please. <laughs> I can see the resemblance. I think I'm gonna pledge this. Need extra, need as much extra land as I can get with this curve. How can I serve? Choose your side! Cameron, why are you doing this? I fought and bled every day since the night that Yushkov came. You've been off playing princess. You abandoned Kosso and our people. A real Orin would not run, sister. Milo's. We put this on him so he combo is making everything progressively bigger. Yeah, that's a pretty good combo. Light the night with flame. order. Drive He's getting out of hand real fast. That's a wonderful combo. Light the night with flame. It's so My rough. signal! Let's make it so they can't block. You get two torches, just one. This one torch doesn't do anything against our board. Ten Grenadier. Follow my lead. Eh, let's just go in. Hey, space, we got this. This is looking our deck plus twelve plus ten. You are tougher than I thought. Very well. We will talk. So apparently they have a sister.
was a fun combo. Parman the Fox. FJS colors. Pledge. Once per turn, you can sacrifice another unit that hit Amy Play to draw a card and give her plus two plus two. That's very situational, but I could see that supporting a more tokensy style. Um, probably working well with uh, Drone Dropper and uh, Milo's, as we just saw. That's that's convenient. Cameron has changed. Gone is the bright girl who chased our brother Marcos up and down the halls of the palace, and who pulled on Papa's beard when he napped. In her place, I see a cold, scarred warrior. I worry for her. For us. Cameron's resistance is small, but they have weathered much under Yushkov's reign. And they have drawn blood. Milos, Cameron, and I plan what comes next. Kosov resistance, rebels from a lost war, and what remains of my bear guard fighting side by side. We are far too few to reclaim Kosul by force, but if we are careful, we might stand a chance. Enjoy the last days of your reign, Yushkov. We come for you. It took our people nearly a thousand years to build the Kosul Empire. It took Yushkov only a matter of months to break it. Cameron and I cannot sit by and watch as he destroys our proud legacy. We have to take the fight to him. Let's see what kind of deck do we have now. Okay, so it's Winchest. FJ, uh, yes. Talk tick, Winchest Cargo, Bannerman. Still have Milos. bear arms anymore. Seems this is more of a token style deck. Don't have drone dropper anymore. But now we have Cameron. Or Carmen, rather. So let's see. We don't have that ridiculous combo like before. But we can still do some pretty crazy stuff. Uh, let's see what happens. and a sleigh. Eh, that's not much. Okay, now I have all my colors. Can't fix it. You know the law. You pay or it's off to the work crews. One way or another, you will contribute to Koso's new glory. These people attached to the edge of ruin. They got nothing left to give. Yet give they shall. The Orin demands tribute. The false Orin will pay for his crimes against the people, along with the bootlickers who support him. Let's see, let's see uh, we've got purple, we've got green. I think we need uh, red the most right here. Second purple. So now I see the combo we're supposed to pull off with uh, Milos and Dora Carmen. Or, well, a combo. How can I serve? Congratulations. I'm happy to relieve you of your duty. Ooh, 
Renegade Valkyrie. Don't try to run. Oh, it is Endurance. I forgot, because it's behind the unblockable symbol. Kill that. Oh wait, I'm dumb, I could have killed this. Well, aside from me misplaying horribly, we're at least blowing up his weapon. Uphold the Iron Fist's legacy. My sword is yours. Meet my axe! That's pretty good. Didn't notice that in my deck. <laughs> Information. Soldiers. This will help fund our operations. Uh, shouldn't we return the money to the people who paid it? Got a point there, my loves. Seems kind of gimmicky. The capital swarms with soldiers. Every one of them hunting us. Cutting his purse strings certainly got Yushkov's attention. We keep to the alleys, strike quickly, and take out as many of these traitorous bastards as we can. And on that note, I think I'm gonna cut it for the next episode here. Uh, let me know if you want me to play other campaigns after this. I'll happily do so. And I'll see you in the next video.